Hey guys, what is going on? It's XCKJ here today. I wanted to bring to you guys a video about off tank Ash, one of the strongest flanks in the game. And I don't even mean that as a joke. Literally, Ash is one of the strongest flanks in the game. You could run down any squishy champions and easily beat them. Um, and with that, you have great zoning tools, you have a shield, you have an amazing ult. I really, really love Ash off tank. And I think that if you guys start playing this, you'll definitely start climbing in ranked. Without a doubt, she's just so strong right now. So let's just talk about builds and some combos first, and then we will jump right into some gameplay. Okay, so for okay, so for your talents, I see people playing Fortress Breaker sometimes. For me personally, I think Battering Ram is the way to go. I think that it's just super strong. You're able to get out of tight spots. If you push too far, Battering Ram just allows you to dip right on out. 75% reduced damage while using Shoulder Bash. It's great. If you guys haven't played it, give it a try. It's really, really good. I would highly recommend it. So Battering Ram. And there's a few different takes on how to play Ash and things like that and how to play builds. But for me, right now, personally, this is the build that I have been absolutely loving. 50% life steal, heal for 60 over 2 seconds for each enemy hit by kinetic burst. This also procs off of shields, this also procs off of turrets, all that kind of stuff. So you can easily be getting a 1200 health over 2 seconds by hitting enemies with kinetic burst. Remember, it is affected by cauterize, as everything is. Vanguard, reduce your damage taken by 24% after using shoulder bash for 2 seconds, just a great card. Reduce the cooldown of Kinetic Burst by 0.6 seconds, just a good one of, and reduce the cooldown of she Siege Shield for 1 second by each enemy hit with Kinetic Burst. So it just reduces the cooldown of the shield after you try to bonk a ton of enemies. Uh, it could be really good, I like it a lot. And it's a whole second, it could be 2 seconds, it could be 3 seconds, it's a good card. Now, as far as items and combos, first we'll just go into items, what I really like to buy. For items, I really love to buy Cauterize. Cauterize 2 is like essential on her. I, she's a great Cauterize applier since her shots explode. She's able to apply Cauterize to multiple enemies at one time. So I love at least going Cauterize 2. Then after I go Cauterize 2, maybe I'll go Cauterize 3. And if not, I'll buy Master Riding. I'll buy Nimble. I'll buy Kronos. I'll buy Haven, Resilience. And if there's a lot of things that need bulldozer on the enemy team i'll buy bulldozer sometimes it's very much dependent on what the enemy team has but some things i do really really love to buy is cauterize and master riding master riding is also really helpful for flanking around into the back line i also see people all the time they buy master riding and they they get off their mount too early like don't demount yourself when playing when if you have master riding just go as far into the back line as you can until you're going to start shooting like there's no reason to get off your mount early before you start shooting so that's some of the items that I really like to buy. Cauterize, Master Riding. As far as combos that you're looking at here, um, one combo that I really like to see a lot is you charge up your Kinetic Burst just like this, and then you go for a Shoulder Bash. So you BAM! Hit them. It knocks them back really far and does huge damage right there. I love how I said BAM like that. Here's how much uh, it will do just normally. So it'll only do half the amount. So you do double damage just by Shoulder Bashing and hitting with Kinetic Burst at the same time. Another thing that I do like to do, kind of, is this little bunny hop. So let's say you're hiding behind a wall like this, right? And you're just like doing a little thing where you're just poking them down, poking them down like that. I like to do charge my kinetic burst behind the wall, jump, shoulder bash. Just kind of jumping. It just helps you get your shoulder bash all faster instead of walking out. You kind of carry your momentum a little bit more. I really like doing it a lot. Uh, other than that, um, there's not too much else to know. Just make sure that you have full ammo because even if you charge your kinetic burst on zero ammo, it's not going to do anything. And also, same exact thing with your ult. One cool thing with your ult, you guys probably know this already, but let's say that there's like something like this, right? You know, your ult typically, your ult typically, you're just going to go bam, ulting big up like this. But in some situations, and then you see something like this. You could do a little, just short bunny hop. You just hit off the ceiling. And depending on where you are, you could hit off the ceiling even faster. If you're in this doorway right here, you can kind of just look at the doorway. Bam, bounce right off of it. And then 
you can uh, get a little short hop. Is they don't expect it, and it is a great way to stun many people at once. There's some areas where it's super easy to do. You won't even need to look up. You're just in a really short ceiling area and just gonna be able to get a bounce. Or if you're like sideways, you know, like something like that. Anyway, guys, we're gonna jump into the gameplay now. But before we do, if you're enjoying the video so far, make sure to leave a like and sub to the channel. It helps me out a lot. It lets me know that what I'm doing, you guys are liking what I'm doing and stuff like that. So. Without further ado, let's jump right into the game. Alright guys. Oh shoot, there's a car going by. Sorry if there's a lot of noise in the background. So my AC is broken in my house. I know I'm lucky I even have AC, so I shouldn't be complaining. But so I have both my windows open, so it might be a little bit noisy because I live on a main road. So sorry about that guys. If that uh if you guys just hear something in the background. But anyway, so we're playing Ash right now. We got battering ram. We got uh the loadout that we had looked out already. And uh, now we're going to be buying a cauterize. And then we're just going to go right out. We actually have a ranked comp with uh, people you can't see. Inara, Furia, and Maeve looking pretty good. They've got a decent comp as well. So it should be a fun game going on right now. It should be an interesting game. We're going to try to hold the left flank for a bit. We don't want to push too hard, but we just want to like keep the flanks from coming in here. Just hold this. There we go. Just poke her down. Oh, we can push right now. Bam. Oh, shoot. She got full health. That sucks. That's okay. Poke that. Kill her. Oh, shoot. I missed. And then just deal some big damage down to this guy right here. We got some regen also from hitting our right click. So the more people we get hit with our right click, the better. Poke this chick down. Nice, nice. We gotta watch out for this. Vivian. Oh, wow. We're low. Okay. Push hard. Trying to get past that shield a little bit. Nice. Let's go. Bam. He's gonna retreat. Let's kill the pupper. I'm sorry, Luna. I have to kill you. I'm also sorry if I call IO Luna. I don't know why I keep on doing that all the time. We're in our back line. We're just gonna chop them to bits. Come here, bud. Oh, thanks. Uh, don't know why Vivian didn't look at me, but thank you, I guess. Oh, come on. Yes, let's go. Oof, no, shoot, I had my ult, I was gonna pop it. Okay, they only have 25%, so we're still gonna be able to get that going. Oh, we're so close to caught two. We're gonna go caught two, and then after we buy caught two, we're gonna get a uh, master riding, because that's just really good. Yep, we have our ult. Oof, nice. Focus Vivian. Always oh, focus the squishies first. Nice. Kill these guys. Ah! Awesome. What was it? Double ult from me and the uh, Anar. That was crazy. Now we have 900 gold. We're going to be able to buy caught too easily. Oh no. I hear Zin back there. Oh no. Rip, man. That sucks. We're, we might die here even. No, no, no. We won't die here. We didn't push too far enough. Don't push that in mine. Oh, no. She got right past us. Or we got right past her. Not what I wanted to have happen. So if you guys see, the combo I really love to do is uh, the right click and the charge at the same time. And then you just double clap them. It does a ton of damage. It's really great. Monty's popping off. Right now, uh, shout out by the way to the Inara right now. Uh, he was, uh, we were just playing a few games and then he was like, oh, you're trying to record a video? And then, so he's playing with us. So that's cool. Ran into him last game. Get him out of here. 
The lag's pretty bad right now. Eh, it's not as bad as it was, though. That's for sure. We got an ult just so we guaranteed get to put it in. Double. Get off of my point. Nice. Alright, let's grab uh, the cot too, and then we'll buy some master riding. This master riding is going to be really helpful just to speed straight on into the back line. Okay, so they said they need help with Zin, so that's what we're going to look for. We're going to look for the Zin. We have our ult also, so that's really strong. We can push. And bam. Hey there, buddy. Oh, wow. Got a lag. Try to poke this guy. We should probably should not be shooting this guy. It's a waste of time, to be honest. Bam! Look at that. That combo is just so strong. You just whack him and deal big damage. Alright, let's hold down this choke right here. Push up on her. The damage is huge. I love once they buff this back from 360 to 400 again. She just became so strong. Really great. Let's try to just use our ult here, honestly. Get her. Yeah, that sucks. That's okay. Wow, he's one and he got away. That's okay. Grab Master right in three. This is gonna be really good for the push. We still are holding on to that ult. Help push this. Oh, nice. Bam! That's perfect ult right there. Got a three man stun. But you don't even want to go for the big stuns, honestly. I like to just go for solo kills a lot of times. Um, seems to be pretty good. Ah! Come here, dude. That sucks. Caught three would be good, but it's not the best. We probably are better off buying Bulldozer. Just since uh, for Vivian ult, for IOs, Dog, for Luna, for these things. The turrets, you know, they got a lot of stuff that it'll be helpful for. I know, she's actually getting healed quite a bit. Boom. IO. Come on, calling her Luna. Poke this guy. Oh, man, he keeps on ulting me. This guy really wants blood. He's after me. Yeah, we'll buy some dozer. It'll be helpful. But honestly, even when we do start shooting Vivian, she she dies like once we focus her down. So her ult isn't too big of an issue. But just in case she's playing super safe or something, get out of here, dude. Wow, well, that was an easy game. A nice 4-0. Clean them up fast. In eight minutes, we clean them up. Hey, I will take that game. Second game in the first game, we got. Uh, an 04, so I'll take this. I'll take this. Good 4 0. Thank you so much, Omega, Rayquaza, and XX Gamer Boy for playing with us. And look at that damage. Look at how much damage you're able to do on Ash as well. Like, seriously, just crazy, crazy amount of damage. Got 15 assists, 12 kills, and 4 deaths. I think if you guys start playing Ash, Trust me, I think you're going to really enjoy her a lot. You're going to enjoy her ult, the damage that she has, the, her ability to zone and everything. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching the video. I hope that you guys do enjoy. If you did, make sure to leave a like and sub to the channel. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.